I am here with Jean-Yves Doncart to talk about a really innovative new product coming from ST, which has a huge number of very diverse applications. So Jean-Yves, tell me more. Yes, indeed, we are extremely excited about the XT60 because this product is allowing us to discuss with various amount of customers in very different fields. Typically, we have already engaged design with customers doing large LED panel, doing waving machine, doing uh, electrical cabinet, doing medical equipment, and even doing mobile phone. And um, indeed, uh, it can be used by any customer using Ethernet protocol, which is the most widely used protocol for high-speed communication. So, what are we talking about technically? Okay, so let's go into the detail. The ST60 is a transceiver allowing us to transmit up to 6 gigabit of data per second over a few centimeters and using the 60 gigahertz RF band. And the use of the 60 gigahertz RF band is bringing out a lot of advantage. First of all, this is a free band allowing high bandwidth transmission. Then 60 gigahertz is absorbed by oxygen. This means very suitable for short distance communication. And then it is crossing plastic and mostly all non-metallic material. Based on that, we develop an Ethernet connector with our partner EPS. And you can wrap all of that up in showing me the demo because yes. I can see plastic and connections. Go and explain it to me. Yes. So basically we have two PC connected through an Ethernet cable. In the middle of this Ethernet cable, we have a pair of uh, modules using the ST60. And then I will copy a large amount of file from this PC to the other one. Okay, so let's engage the copy. We can see that the copy is operating at basically one gigabit per second. If I separate the two modules, then the transfer is interrupted. Okay. I put them back again and the transfer is resetting. Okay, at full speed, immediately. And what about using ST and uh, 60 in designing the product then? There is two ways of using the ST60 for customers, depending on their RF knowledge and the volume that they are needing to do. First solution is to use an already made module, typically the one made by your partner IPS, okay, where you can have two versions, the one with propagation in the plan of PCB and the one with propagation perpendicular of the PCB. And the other option is to use directly ST reference design, okay, where we can have multiple kinds of antenna, typically antenna with propagation in the plane of the PCB, antenna propagation perpendicular to the PCB, or even rotating antenna allowing 360 degree rotation. We have as well an antenna inside the package in order to fulfill the application where the footprint area is very critical. Where can I find out more? On st.com slash st60. Jean-Yves, thank you.